It's K-pop reaction time! Ah, yeah! Hey, today we got a video from... Sight! Sight! <laughs> That's right! We're going back to old school! Wow. To his Gundam style video, which came out in 2012, <laughs> Lulu! Dang! This was a song that honestly broke the K-pop world wide open to so many people here in America. For the first time, huh? For the first time, For yeah. It wasn't like the first wave, I think, for K-pop. I mean, this song went hugely viral, viral everywhere in the world. And honestly, by then, Sai was already pretty big in Korea. He's already had like a dozen or so songs released. He was already up to his sixth album. The dude was already prolific. But this was what took him to worldwide fame. And quite frankly, he also changed the name of the game. What's that? What's the game? The game as a music artist was always about record sales. How many records can you sell? And he proven for the first time, really on a global scale, if you can make it big on YouTube, you can make it big as an international star, as an international singer. This song was the first one that cracked through a billion views first. And it was unheard of because at that time you had songs like Justin Bieber, all these Western hits that everyone thought dominated the charts on YouTube. And mm. boom, all on comes Psy and proves, nah, nah, y'all don't get the game. You need to be making a video like this. <laughs> I remember this music video was so memorable. Mm -hmm. It wasn't just the music video, the song. The, the song hook. was so good, the hook. And the dance move. Mm -hmm. And he's one of those talents that has always broken the mold, if you will. A single K-pop star who basically creates all his own stuff. I know. He doesn't even look like a typical K-pop artist. K-pop star, He's yes. kind of chunky. <laughs> but man, when he moves, oh, he's so good. He is definitely a very good dancer. Oh. So yeah, this song for me was just, there was so much about it that I was really proud of. Mm -hmm. As someone who was Asian American, who saw someone like him, who had the same body shape as me, <laughs> quite frankly, um, and who made it this big, made me very proud. And the fact that so many people here in America, at first they were like, what is this thing? This is the corniest, dumbest thing. It's just like today's version of Old Town Road, mm. a viral hit for the time. That's right. Well, let's watch this Again, after six, seven years. Mm hmm It's gonna feel fresh. Yeah. All right, let's check it out. And away we go. God, I love the hook right off the bat. Open Gangnam Style. Gangnam Style. He's so silly. <laughs> I remember the kid. Oh, that's right. He's got crazy moves. Look at that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's got so much sass. Oh my god, he's so good. Oh my god, I remember those dance moves, everybody was doing them. Uh. You know what's funny? He did so much research about like, what to do with this dance move. He was trying to figure out what move could I do <laughs> that was going to take off. And he went through the whole animal kingdom. He had a panda dance, like a monkey dance. I mean, literally, oh, he see. came up with all sorts of crazy moves around animals. And he finally settled, riding a horse. This is what's going to take off. And he spent a lot of time trying to get the dance moves right. Oh, 
Oh my god, I forgot how good this was, man. <laughs> Dance off. Star. Holy lordy. Oh my gosh. The best. Oh god. What an iconic. Is that iconic movie? That was That's absolutely right. iconic. I mean, next to the word <laughs> iconic in the dictionary is of his face. <laughs> Sigh. It is just oh. an amazing song. It's like no wonder it went viral. Although I think. It went viral even without the music video, but the music video was absolutely the thing that like, everyone shared on the internet. Mm, exactly, because it's just like random. Random, but it fits to... The reason why I think this is such a powerful piece, why I think it's such a great example of what K-pop could be, is that it didn't follow a formula that you tend to think of like K-pop's produced like in a company. You know what I'm mm. saying? It's like, it's all produced. Right. He was able to completely just throw that out the window, make fun of himself at the same time, <laughs> write a catchy hook, still have the amazing performance, still have the amazing production values that went beyond most things that you see in an American music video. And mm. so to see this for the first time, you literally have to watch it three, four times to pick up all the ridiculous stuff that somehow he's able to shove into one video. Oh my goodness. Like those dancers were like <laughs> with the wind, that was like trash. Do you and, imagine? And like if you're the <laughs> if you're like size choreographer, he's like, no, no, this is too serious. I want something like where you have to crawl through the lady's legs and you're dry humping the ground. I need something more of that. And you're like, I did not become a famous dancer to come up with stupid stuff like dancing on a horsey yo. Oh my goodness. Oh, that lady with the pink at the end, it looks like she is famous, huh? She is actually. I think she, I don't remember who she was, but she is a famous K-pop idol as well. Oh, yeah. I figured because she's, I just realized that now that we are watching this again. See, I see. Oh gosh, I love this Oh my this god, song. Sai is just an icon. You are absolutely right.